Exercises one through five contain a while loop and a predicate. In each case, show that if the predicate is true before entry to the loop, then it is also true after exit from the loop. So the predicate here is that 2n plus 1 is less than or equal to 2 to the n. We get to assume that this is true before entry to the loop. We are also assuming that we initially satisfy the condition for this loop, which is that n is greater than or equal to 3 and n is less than or equal to 100. We have to determine whether or not this predicate is true after exit from the loop. Now, n is going to be some number between 3 and 100. Each time we iterate through this while loop, n is going to increment by one unit each time. So if n starts at 4, then n is going to increase to 5, and then n is going to increase to 6, and n is going to increase to 7, and n is going to continue to increment until the condition of this while loop is no longer satisfied. Now, the only reason why the condition of this while loop would not be satisfied is if n increases too much. n is never going to decrease, so we're never going to have to be concerned about this condition being violated, that n is greater than or equal to 3, because n is always going to be greater than or equal to 3, since n is being incremented by 1 and n is increasing. So that means the only way we can fail this while loop condition is if n is greater than 100. Now, if n is an integer, which I think it's assumed to be an integer, then that would mean that n would equal 100 at the end of this while loop. So that means by the end of this while loop, n equals 101. So now we have to ask ourselves, is the predicate still satisfied? Is it still true that 2n plus 1 is less than or equal to 2 to the n for n equals 101? Well, we can check that. 2 times 101 plus 1 is 203. And 2 to the 101, well, that's a really big number. I don't think I can put that down in this whiteboard. Uh, but it's way, way bigger than 203. And in particular, it's greater than or equal to 203, which means that this predicate is satisfied for n equals 101. This means that the predicate is satisfied after exit from the while loop. Anyways, thanks everyone, and I'll see you in the next video.